Hi, and welcome to Endless Mode. I'm Boku Bell. I'm Mysterious Gamer X. I'm Captain Emoji. And I am special guest T. Stymac. And we are going to play some Dark Souls. <laughs> play is a generous uh, uh, descriptor play of what's going to happen. Lively. I'm going to play Dark Souls. <laughs> um, you will also be here. I will experience it, and uh, I am going to do the best thing that I can do, which is character creation. And I have a strict five-minute limit on that. So, starting now... Okay, 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 I can do this. Uh... Alright, so... <laughs> Don't talk, just say! Deprived is what I choose, Pyromancer is the best okay, choice. Okay, there we go. Uh... <laughs> uh... Twin Humanities. I was gonna say, all I know is that there's trap options for some of these. Oh, yeah, like... There's an entire stat that is a noob trap. Really? One Whoa. whole stat <laughs> in this game. Okay. I did not okay. know that. This is true. I also did not uh, know that when I, I was a noob. I just know that there's a couple of the items. One of them literally doesn't do anything, and it says so. And I'm like, I'm okay with that. For the person who wants to go to private. It's like a locket or something. Mm -hmm. And then there's, like, uh, binoculars, which oh, I guess no. is also a trap. Oh, no! Like a, a oh, no! Oh, no! None are good! Yeah, you can buy that. All but, are bad! Yeah. First shot. Right. These are... This is why it's a dark soul. It's because the hair is very bad. Oh, you are undead. Well, I was gonna say, this is the this is the non-undead face, sporty. though. That's like, One yeah. minute? You kind of start... Fuck! I mean, okay. <laughs> you you kind of start out looking like Spawn, don't you? Isn't that... That <laughs> yeah, there's game. there's our swear for you the game, look like guys. You kind of inside of a meat pie with eyes. <laughs> a little, yeah. We're gonna okay. spend most of the game looking like that. Okay. Oh okay. really? Oh okay. yes. Oh. Okay. God. Oh, the menu is already defeating uh, you have me. To, you have to get a name. Is that customized? Oh, name. Uh. <laughs> nope. We didn't okay. Talk about the names, did we? No, I, we did not. That's why I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm gonna bless us from the start. <laughs> Lucky. <laughs> and oh. nothing named Lucky ever does well. I started tradition with my, uh... God, how do I... Using the buttons that it tells you to on the okay, screen. Okay, thanks, thanks. Okay, uh, Jubilant Katrina. Boo! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Somebody's All right. a little gone. Some of them look no, more like faces, give me, though. Give me back my, my woman! I no, particularly, yeah. uh... Because I subscribe to the Monster Factory School of Character Creation, enjoy the random button, but you only have uh, two minutes and forty-five seconds. Oh God, I have very little time. Okay. Uh... But yeah. Why did her? It, just, it seems like you kind of look like a, a hell spawn, like from spawn. The Hormones. For, oh boy, they tried I've to seen. get <laughs> delicate on this one, huh? Yeah. <laughs> You're okay. Strong. <laughs> Strong like bull. But let's... God, why did this happen again? Okay. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I really can't Hold wait on. until she gets to the no, customized no, portion of God, the menu. God, 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 Christ. God. You know, I think short cropped hair. You're, you're in a, you're in a hell state. No, I can't stand it. Okay. 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 Customize. Now, okay. now we're getting into the real sliders. Unfortunately, there are two minutes to go. Oh, God. This is kind of like watching an episode of, like, Chop. Oh, those God! Kind of shows. <laughs> this is about the point where the person oh. sticks their hand in the still-moving blender to try and, like, save time and scoop something. And then they just put another glove on the bleeding hand. My favorite okay. thing okay. in any of those cooking shows is when someone cooks themselves and bleeds okay. on the food, and the judge that? says, I'm not going to eat Nose, that. Nose, eyes, yeah. eyebrow, and, you know, entire as, as, as eyes. As they're, as they're okay, now let's do entire. Hand. What? Uh... <laughs> I didn't get any in your portion. Where I is her nose bridge? Is that a thing? Bridge. Bridge, like, where's the bridge? Uh, it's bridge probably debt. a thing, but this was a game made by nerds who don't know that term. Okay. <laughs> also, What's their word for it, yeah. You also, gotta... the sliders move some of the other sliders. I just want to point that No, out. don't tell me it now! It's great, I love it. Everything about this game is perfect. <laughs> okay. So... You've got a minute. Oh, God! Okay. Well, I, I say a minute, but really it's 50 seconds, so... Okay, okay. I hope you really Back. like the nose action. The best part about this is that what is going to happen at the end of this 
Is and she is going to try and accept the thing that she has <laughs> and created, I'm reset and it. she's going to reset it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. That's what's going to happen. Just waiting for that, really. I'm, I'm rooting for uh, you. I think uh, we're going to be fine. We're going to hit that accept oh, button. Oh, not narrow. Oh no, Watch. get me out of narrow. <laughs> Thirty seconds. <laughs> okay, wait. How does that keep happening? Okay, well she's got the crazy eyes now, but I'm okay, <laughs> that's okay. with that. Okay, everyone in Dark Souls Back. is crazy. It makes sense. Cheeks. You have no idea. Cheekbones. We're 15? good. We're good. She's cute. God. Ten. Jaw. Suddenly we don't have time for this. I think the chin looks Five, good. Five. Oh, God. Four. Three. Two. One. There we go. Oh, okay. Done. Okay. Pencils okay. Okay. That's lucky. Back. Okay. Okay. Now. And, and initialize, I'm assuming? Yes. Bottom left? That's right. Okay. Why? How did that happen? What happened? It reset. Did it? Oh. Did it? It did. Oh. Well, it's been five minutes, so... Oh, God. Well... We're just gonna have to take our flawed, beautiful child into the world oh. of Lord Dran the way she is. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, initialize is reset everything oh, to default. Oh, is it? Oh, I'm God. sorry. Oh, yeah! yeah okay, go well back. Then, you well press then... the B button. Oh, okay. Back. Oh. Well, that's... But this time, accept is the right button. That's dumb. Yeah. This thing, This game is very... Strange and opaque uh -huh. in a lot of ways. Yeah, I really love the controls so far. I'm really into it. In the age of We're having a hard okay. time fighting the menu beast. I just don't know how well this is going to go. Well, now the game took my child from me, so I, I'm i going to not be playing with it so much as against it. That's probably for the best. Although we're talking over this very interesting lore. <laughs> oh, everlasting! I mean, how often are we gonna interact? Everlasting with this dragons. I mean, we're gonna dodge Imagine. roll all of it to death. <laughs> Imagine dragons. Except for the dragons, <laughs> actually. We're not. No, we're gonna dodge roll a dragon to death. Maybe two, depending on how ambitious we are. Why are we exploring the intestine of the earth? Because uh, that's it's like where, a geological that's where colonoscopy. Like there's a there's a lot there's a lot to unpack. You know what? I still don't care because they did take the child from me and replace her with some sort of pinch-faced maniac. From the dark. Are you upset that Dark Souls has swooped into your room at night, snatched your child from its crib, and replaced it with a with sinister changeling? changeling? Yeah. You know what? <laughs> I don't care if my child is replaced with a sinister changeling. It'll probably do better in public schools. I just want it to be a cute one. As long <laughs> That's as all that I'm looking for here. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah. First of the dead. So it's like he the first the, the first guy that died or well, no, why does he have skulls. Skulls. why does he have, have six skulls died. if he's the first? Yeah. Something I really like about uh the Witch of Isolith is that her hands are burned. I don't know if anybody else noticed that fun detail. It, it, it's not important. I thought maybe they were actually burning currently. I'm sorry to tell. No, they're a little roasty toasty there. I was like, I don't think that's how my magic's supposed to work. You're not supposed to be a candle. <laughs> Are you? I think you can turn humans into candles pretty easy. I I know there's like torches and you like. I've heard this game described as being principally about setting yourself on fire. <laughs> Good thing we chose the fireman's class then. I admit, oh, I know nothing so about this. <laughs> I have only ever watched, like, videos of people turning into chairs. And that's my pretty much my experience with the Dark Souls. That's a very specific... That is, it's... Uh, facet, okay. <laughs> well, that's just, that's what I've been exposed to. So, is he a good guy, or...? <laughs> well... I, I, I are there good guys? I was gonna say, I get the impression uh, that they're, like... Fundamental underpinnings of something, but I that don't is know, a dragon I don't know with shadings. Why the, is the it so naked? <laughs> oh, we need batteries for the controller. That seeth the scaleless. Uh, as the the text at the bottom of the screen helpfully informed us a moment ago. Ah. So, is he the dragon we stab? Yes. Cool. Everybody in that uh, cutscene is somebody that, except for the the big dragons. Now, can anybody name actual cities that are built in the shape of a giant wheel like that? Because I've seen it in so many different games and. There's a lot of cities that start that way. Yeah. Like Great Falls is nothing but a numbered grid until everybody decided that was a bad idea. Yeah, but I mean specifically hill, castle on hill, wheel shape, even spokes. High walls on the outside. Happened a fair bit in Greece. The when Vatican. They got to build a city. Okay. In the Vatican. Carriers of the 
fairly defensible. Uh, so they deal. they only could budget in three colors for this game, huh? Red, brown, gray, black. Yeah. They spent the rest of the money on the combat mechanics. Okay. Uh, it looks like it's looks like it's okay for now. Cracked red eye orb. This is the game's principal method of communicating us uh, ideas to us. So the more you die, the more you learn. Well, these are item descriptions. You can find them in the item menu. In but... theory, we could spend an hour reading all of our junk and get the same same uh, lore. Uh, Dan Floyd from Extra Credits did a really good Let's Play of the entire series, actually. And he does that at the end of certain episodes. I don't think we should. If you want that, go go watch oh, it. Someone's I'm, already done it. Somebody already did it. I'm not that invested because, again, they did steal my child. So. Yeah. This is a hundred hour game, and I'm going to hear about that all hundred hours, aren't <laughs> yep. I? Yup. Fair enough. Why would the button <laughs> well, say confirm? If it just reset the situation. Well, I mean, it said initialize. And it Which means say start. What initialize does. Oh my! You shouldn't have to read the tiny print to know that initialize means two different things on two different menus. Oh, you're we're gonna, gonna have die a bad a lot. time in Dark Souls. I, I know we're gonna have a bad time. That's why I, I have was here. The, the nested Matroshka doll of menus is a little bit obtuse, but um, <laughs> you know, we'll get there. So, who's on the controls right now? Uh, I, Boku Bell, am on the controls right now. So we're gonna enjoy me until I die. With each death, we're gonna be handing it off. Um, two of us are not good, and two of us are pretty okay. So who's the second pretty okay one? Uh, Mysterious Gamer X. Yeah, Mysterious Gamer X. I think uh, you can. By by virtue of playing similar games, at least. Oh, fair enough. Um, I mean, I'm about to commit blasphemy and say that Monster Hunter and its ilk are similar. No, that's but, fair. But they're the okay. They have similar aims. Pillage uh, corpse. Okay. What does this do? Uh, uh, it's a broken sword. Let's we'll see, you pulled up the thing in your... Okay. Do not... Well, I just used that. Up. The Twin Humanities. It's fine. Yeah. What's the Twin Humanities? Okay, so this is... What's this? Well, now we have two Humanity, if you look at the top left. Oh. That's a... Okay, so is this is good? a stab, and then... Ah! That's a really strong stab. Okay. All right. So, we, we have done this tutorial before, and I wonder <laughs> if... Hey! Right stick, camera <laughs> controls. Yeah, yeah. I'm a, last time I uh, was uninterested in this. And how'd that play out for you? Stab that guy. Uh, I, I will say that originally we oh, keep, boy. keep stabbing that guy. Well, I'm having a little trouble. So these guys won't attack you. Um, you you can't dodge before you get to the first checkpoint. What's up, home skillet? Oh. We can fight that guy if we want. Oh, you know I'm dying for it. Strong attack. Good okay. choice of words given the, the franchise. Okay, okay. <clears throat> okay, so this so is the quick stabby. On. Is there? Yeah, but it doesn't explain how to do that yet. That's, That's right. later oh, yeah. scorch marky things. Left stick read. and hold B to dash. Okay. And you see you got your green stamina bar and that went down when we okay. were Okay. Let's experience uh. this together. Right stick target lock release. Okay. So I think you press in the. Is it locking? No, that's, that's your left, left stick. stick. Oh. Yeah, I have a freckle on my finger, and it's the only way that I can tell uh, my right's from my left's apart. When I was in high school, I dated a girl with one arm who, for the life of her, could not figure out which was her right or left arm. <laughs> Huh. That's a, that's a, a fair... Uh, I'm not laughing at yeah. I just think that that's delightful. We have the same dilemma. All right. Okay. Well, not quite the same. <laughs> we, well, you know what? Almost the same if you think about it. Okay, rest at the bonfire. Now, light the bonfire. Hey, now, bonfire okay, lit. Okay, and so I have to rest in order to re reload. What's a tune magic do for me? This is where uh, we can equip spells. Right now, we've only got one. We've also only have the. Uh... And is it equipped? Or no, already? actually, we've got. Yeah, it, it's already equipped, but we can equip it again if we want. Okay. How do I? So you. Yep. Yeah. And A. Okay. Oh, I think. Pressing it. Okay. Click. Click B. Okay. And uh, let's see here. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, I don't care that I much, could, actually. I was so. going to say, I'll bet I could do it if it was in my hand. So how All do right. we 
use the magic? Uh, if you click X, it, it, well, it'll it'll teach you. It'll teach you in a minute. Okay, so, all right, I got an idea on how the lock works. Now, before you walk into this room all the way, I want you to do something for me. All right. And that is look, look up. You see that guy up there's there? A, there's a, uh, a real... Real big boy. Real yeah. big... Carrying a... It looks like... It a looks wing. like basically... A pillar. Pete the dragon, but maybe going through like kind of like a dark... Grim dark Post reboot. middle school Grim dark phase. reboot. Right, right. Okay. Like a, like a 90s reboot of Pete the dragon. So that's the great thing about Dark Souls is uh, this game is very harsh, but it is also very fair. Uh-huh. Like, he does exist somewhere before he comes in to take all of our things. That's right. Oh, wait, no. Run. 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 <laughs> run. Run. Nope. Here's our guy. This way. Now, right. that door's okay. locked. Now, now, we can fight him and beat him. Right now. Cool. Yeah, uh, we could. What do you mean, we, my dude? I mean, I couldn't. Okay. I said we people can people can and have. Okay, so well, we not saying. me. Yeah. So how am I gonna? Hey, there's ah, a door. There's a door. Okay, I don't know if this is actually the correct way to be traveling, but that's the way that I figured out to move a little bit faster. You're just gonna somersault your way to victory. <laughs> I'm pretty much just gonna you tuck know, and roll. The dodge roll is. It's true. It's, it's it is an important uh, aspect of the game. Now, is that auto saving me when I rested a bonfire? Uh. Dark Souls will autosave anytime you do anything. Get your shield. There's like a little flame symbol in the top right hand corner that pops up whenever it decides that there's an important thing to save. But And literally anything in so this I game. So I can't I can't jump. No. Well you can, it's just that the jump command is very unintuitive. Where is the shield? Is it in this room? I'm guessing not, but Okay. So that is what it means when there's an item you can pick up. Ow. So now we're going to learn how to equip things. Okay, cool. So the first thing you want to do... Oh, here we go, never mind. Uh, start, okay. All right, bear with me, team. I am still I guess it does teach you everything. The it does. Just not in a fun way? <laughs> yeah, this is kind of like, like this when... Isn't, this isn't, you know, first stage of Mario. Hey, look Sorry, at me do my... things. I feel there like I'm go. gaining mastery of them. It is just sort of... Now, it how reminds I... me of all the other Nintendo games that weren't the first stage of Mario, where you had to read a manual. Uh, okay. There you go. I will. Okay. I will and the admit... manuals scrawled on the floor of the game, but essentially that's what's happening here is, is we're having to read what do. Reading the manual actually is very helpful with Dark Souls. <laughs> Again, I, I feel it harkens back to perhaps okay. a different era of gaming in some ways. Okay. I suppose that's one way to look at it. Yeah. Where where they where they assume that you're going to do that? Wait, do I want to do that? You don't, sense. and the reason is if you uh, click Y, you see that uh, third line equip load. Yeah. Uh, depending on what our equip load is, we're going to be able to move faster, dodge faster, okay. uh, have better stamina recovery, okay. all that kind of thing. So we want to keep that number pretty oh. low. All right. There is a point where you are able to uh, you dodge roll worse. If your equip load is too high. Huh, I did not know that. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Okay. Now there's... There you go. That seems to do, like, big people damage. And yeah, because it's... Like, it's... <laughs> broken sword. It's big... almost like it's not a broken sword. <laughs> it's true. It's like it's a real weapon. Big boy damage. Let me through! But... Everything in this game, uh, it's it's going to pull a lot of cheap tricks on you, but if you take a minute and look around, or you know they're coming, and then you take a moment to look around, I should say, right. you'll see that they aren't actually cheap tricks. Okay. I don't know why I'm disparaging cheap tricks so much. They're one of my favorite bands. <laughs> nah. Turn around. Why? Can you get through that wall? No, oh, that wall is still closed. Yeah. Still closed, implying something bad <laughs> is coming. Oh, oh yep. <laughs> so, so, and that was there the whole time. I feel like I feel like your message was uh, interestingly timed, as if you knew <laughs> that we were going to walk right into that. 
I know for a fact every one of you have played this tutorial. I mean, I, I've had a lot of concussions, was, so I don't remember a lot. That's true. That was months and months ago when we first talked about this. Yeah. I don't remember yeah, things so much as I sort of age, memento my life. <laughs> Oh. That's cool, dude. Can we have your shield? Give me That is your a really shit. good shield. Thank you. And, uh... Can I just have your armor also? In fact, can we just... I mean, you're dying, right? Can we just trading spaces our equipment, or... <laughs> Alright, whatever. No. Well, I mean, he gave you the magic, uh... Yeah, he gave you a health potion. The, the, the magic gin and juice bottle there. <laughs> you can click X to use health potion. Estus Flask. Okay. It's basically five health so potions that death refresh. Death came at the from end of up this. there. Yeah. All right. Uh, we'll find out if there is. Ah, okay. Hold on. Oh, ow! Thanks. Timing and spacing are very important in this game. Cool. Like, I have uh, some some lag in that. Uh, mashing R one is probably not gonna get you the best of results. Well. Which one's R one? Or maybe no, R2? The, the trigger or the bumper? The shoulder button is going to be your regular attack. The uh, trigger is your heavy attack. I could have swore it was okay. reversed, but that would explain a lot. Left stick plus... Oh, God. Okay. I've officially run out of, of interest in knowing all of these things, so this is going to be... Left stick and right trigger jump attack. I mean, I don't think you can practice too much of that in that, like, hallway, because I don't see jumping being super useful, but... How am I jumping? Sorry. Uh, it was uh, forward and right trigger. Okay, that's very intuitive. Is it though? Okay, I'm done. With, <laughs> with, no, I'm, I'm not going to be able to get that down here. I okay. will. Oh, resting at bomb fighters revives enemies. It does. That's probably important. Oh. I will say this for Dark Souls, the controls are more intuitive than uh, Killer7. I have not door? played that. I was going to say, oh. I, having, having played Killer7 and No More Heroes and its ilk, uh, oh, and of course, oh. Uh, oh. Let, it, uh, let It Die, their most nope. recent one, uh, yep. nothing yes. is intuitive. I want to take a poll off I, I gave, I, In Let It Die, I gave up eating health items... <laughs> or, uh, well, I gave up eating health items in combat, and I gave up using, uh, any of the damage dealing items at all, because depending on how you press the button... Oh, yeah, you got a sorcery flame that you can equip in one of your hands, and that lets you use pyros pyromancy. Okay. So, depending on how you press the button surface on the oh, PS4, definitely. the big, this like, touchpad... This is... Okay, this is bad teaching. This is bad. <laughs> when you're driving... You're learning how to drive. They don't just, as you're driving, use this and learn that. Oh, definitely killed three pedestrians. You know Why what? Why can't you remember nine things at once? If we lived in Dark Souls world, they probably would teach you like that. Well, in Dark Souls world, there wouldn't <laughs> That's why they be don't have cars. cars. There would. There That's would. Why they don't oh, have cars. well. Oh, he's dead. Uh, let's pass it off. But let it die. I stopped using Clock the damage wise. dealing items because depending on how you swipe on the uh, PS4 pad you could possibly eat the damage dealing item and then blow yourself up. Okay, so we've just handed off to Mysterious Gamer X. Boku Bell is out. How'd you like your first uh, on-camera Dark Souls experience? Mediocre your, your and boring. Your trial by fire, if you will. <laughs> keeping with the uh, toasty theme. Of the... It'll be fun eventually, but uh, uh, this is this is I will say the Not a I've... natural tutorial for me, at least. I will say the impression I've gotten from the internet in general is that fun is a little ways off in this game. Uh, like, in general. Like, you have to get comfortable with it before you can really approach anything fun with it. Hey, you got a backstab. Good job. That was really unnecessary. I mean, what my impression of this is a game that's fun when you get skilled and it rewards you for working hard. And yeah. I'm too old and tired to enjoy working hard in a game. <laughs> and so I admire the people who do know how to work hard and have mastered this and are super into it. Uh, but it's going to be a struggle. I'll try to be good-natured about it, though. I don't want people to not have fun. Jump, damn you. So, apparently we can't get to that yet, but... Dark Souls is, like I said before, 
is always harsh, but also always fair. So we're going to be able to get there eventually. Harsh but fair sounds like the excuse of an absentee dad. <laughs> that's, yeah. <laughs> like, a, like a 1950s TV dad. Yeah, that's a... Yeah, kind of, a, kind of like a Don Draper and his children situation. Do, has anybody watched Mad Men anymore? I no- stopped, I think, season four, maybe three... You know, it's, it, it got it's boring that opening courtyard area. to me. It got it got good again. You got a lot more of the characters who were more interesting than uh, Ham Sandwich. Ham Sandwich. Dan Harmon. No, <laughs> hold on, John Ham. You were right the first time. <laughs> God, he's a very handsome boy, though. God, yeah. Jeez. Uh, he did a show with Elijah Wood. Some, it was some uh, Netflix original. It, it was Danny Rads. Uh, God damn it! You you are correct, and I even <laughs> knew that you were correct. I even knew the name. I think it's happened so many times in their life, though, that at this point it's it's interchangeable. <laughs> Have you ever seen that picture? I'm trying to remember if it was Daniel Radcliffe or Elijah Wood. Uh, somebody wanted them to sign a photograph yes. of the other. Right. Right. It and was, they did. It was Daniel Radcliffe, and I think he was in Japan, if I remember, or it was a Japanese tourist, and he didn't have the language to explain what was going on, so he did sign it, which is very... That's very sweet. Um, it reminds me of that, like, absolutely ancient Simpsons episode with the, uh, uh, one of the other bums signing a picture of, uh, Sean Connery. (laughs) <laughs> because they they just didn't realize that he was a different one of the bonds. Oh, so if you look at the top left, we just recovered our souls, and uh, we also recovered our humanity. That number is two now. So what is what is the souls? Uh, the souls are our numbers in our bottom right, and they are an, our experience points and our currency for everything. Okay. So the more things we kill, the more souls we get? That's right. And that's how we level up. It's like our XP, I guess. There's a spendable resource. That's right. Uh, I don't know what humanity is for, though. I'll be honest. Uh, I don't think we ever, the last time we played this, got to the point where you use humanity. But it does a couple of things. Good job! Nice. Uh, one of the things... Cinematic. But I know it's Dark Souls, so I know it wasn't a cinematic, but you actually had to do that. Yep. I, I admit I really like the monster design. I know everybody does, but it it is genuinely interesting. It's hard to dislike the monster design in this game. Uh, so how do I dodge roll? B. B. B button in a direction. Okay. My signature move. <laughs> hey, I think uh, Mysterious Gamer X is going to get us past. Yeah! yeah! All right! Good we job! The, oh, that guy, that guy. <clears throat> the tutorial demon. That's once, right. Once you're not uh, using a broken sword. Take us to <laughs> okay. the fun land. Yeah, the we, land we didn't know that there was a tutorial. side room, I think, the first time we played this, and so we just charged at it with a broken Oh, room. we <coughs> you guys did. frustrated. And poked it with a thumbtack until I'm it got not mad used and to a game, smashed our face. I'm not used to a game giving me an option to not face the problem head on and just punishingly deal with it so you can move on to the next thing. And that would be refreshing if I wasn't mad at games for doing that all the time. <laughs> right, like, uh, even games where they, you know, tout the non-combat option. Right. Uh, like, uh, was it Dave Sex Human Revolution? Like, you can play a character that talks his way out of things, except for, like, a handful of instances where they're like, no, the only option is bullets entering mm-hmm. other people. And I didn't put any, bullet- I didn't put any like, points in that. I don't have any mods for it. Well, you're going to have to be a crack shot those five times. <laughs> yep, pretty much. Oh, hey, I'm a snack. Hello, Boyd. I thought we beat the tutorial monster. <laughs> oh, okay. Gandalf it, it's a finally called the eagles. It, it's not going to hurt us. We're fine. To the land of the ancient lords. All right. So we weren't even at the place yet. It literally was Tutorial Town. And so did we just break into it. some dragon's house and Stone Cold murder his friends and no, him? No, we were in prison. Asylum. And we just killed the jailer. The reason you guys were in prison... Uh, Nurse Ratchet. <laughs> ...is because you were, uh... You're undead, which is why you can keep coming back to life forever. But... Uh, people who are undead will eventually go insane from it. Like, like the ones that we saw that were just sort of like mindless sword zombies. Exactly. 
And so they just That's lock everybody up. Everybody is, is that. I feel like yep. being a mindless sword zombie sounds like a better deal than being a sentient person in this nightmare. You know, and some people probably feel that way. And then they go hollow. Sooner. And then they go hollow. Oh, and so I, I'm, I already lost this game, <laughs> essentially, on the inside. Alrighty. Well, we're gonna do some leveling up here, and then we'll catch you next time on Endless Mode. And I'll learn the buttons sometimes. So, we'll see how this goes. And thank you to our guest, T. Stymac. Always a pleasure. Thanks, Mr. T. No problem. <laughs> uh, I thought uh, you guys nickname. said I didn't have to have a dumb nickname. You have a well, new it's nickname, too late now, and your okay. new nickname is also trademarked. Okay, guys, thank you so much. Catch us next time on Endless Mode. Like and subscribe, and uh, see you later. Bye. Bye. Bye.